What kind of stuff do you put on a cover letter? What kind of is it comparable to the body of the email? Or? So here's the thing. Most formal is going to be to write a separate cover letter, attach it as a separate document, along with your resume. In that case, the body of your email can just be enough that sort of says, Dear Sir or Madam, Madam uh, attach, please find my resume and cover letter in reference to the opening for such and such. Please let me know if you have any difficulty opening these documents or if you require any additional information. I look forward to hearing from you. Sincerely, Armstrong. And then you can attach them. Now, alternatively, you could simply take your cover letter, cut it out of the Word document, paste it into the body of your email. What's the downside to this? Okay, they're reading the same thing twice, in which case you probably wouldn't want to attach maybe the attachment version of your cover letter. But what's the other downside to it being in the body of the email versus in an attachment? Does it look nice? Yeah, you lose the formatting. You lose the pretty formatting, which I know seems a little bit silly, but in reality, like most people still are going to print those documents out at some point, whether it's while they're reviewing them or once we get to the interview stage, they're going to print them out and you want them to look pretty because we are into things being aesthetically pleasing. So you lose a bit of that formatting if you've just cut and pasted it into the body of the email. Now, that's not to say that it can't be done and it hasn't been done and, and is never okay. I've seen it done. The, the biggest problem is you don't know what type of email program they're using, so you do not know how that formatting is going to come through. And all of the nice formatting that you've done, kind of, you have to assume kind of goes out the window. 